February, February 24, February 24, Wendy out here. February 24, what is one essential piece of fishing apparel that will help you catch more fish? <laughs> That's pretty easy, isn't it? Good morning, guys and girls. February 24, February 24. Reading from a Catch a Better Life book on the Catch a Better Life channel. If you are not subscribed to this channel, please subscribe to this channel right now. Some of y'all that are over there on Facebook and uh, see this on Facebook because we have over 600,000 folks on Facebook and, and uh, they, uh, we post this uh, video over there on Facebook. Plus we have the, 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 the print of the book so you can read along at the same time. You want your own copy of the book, you can get it at jimmyhouston.com plus Bass Pro and Cabela's and just about any place books are sold. But uh, those of you that are on Facebook, come over here and get involved with us on our YouTube channel. Also, you'll meet a lot of new friends over there and have a, have some great, develop some great relationships with them. If you are not subscribed to the Catch a Better Life channel on YouTube, please subscribe to that channel right now. We start each day with a, a scripture from the Word of God, a devotional built around fishing and a fishing tip for every day. February 24, we're looking at John 16, 33. These things I have spoken to you that in me you may have peace. In the world, you will have tribulation, but be of good cheer because I have overcome the world. Those are red letters. Yes, sir. That's Jesus Christ speaking right there himself. Here's what I wrote about that. One of the worst storms I've ever encountered on water, even to this day, was way back in 1976, the year I won my first BASS Angler of the Year title. That storm included high winds, included a lot of rain, lots and lots of lightning, Plus, the really dangerous part, heavy and very large hail. Definitely life-threatening. Not only did my God see me through those storm, that storm, but I won the tournament. I won the tournament as well and went on throughout the year to, to, to end up you know, being the top guy of the year. Jesus spoke these words in today's scripture to his closest friends. Get this. Right before he was arrested, right before he was crucified, Jesus knew exactly what was about to happen and how his followers would be treated once he had been crucified. They would have tribulation. They would have lots of tribulation. They would be persecuted. They would have trials that they couldn't even imagine. And so this is what he was talking to them about. And he's also talking to you and me as well when he tells us this verse. He was telling you and me to take courage. He was telling us to be confident. Jesus was telling us to be happy, to be happy even during our tribulations, even do our, do our, through our problem circumstance. Jesus has taken away the power of Satan, the devil himself, to harm us. Jesus has taken that power away from him. So go out and live today in victory. You serve an awesome, you serve a powerful God. You have victory. You have victory through Jesus no matter what. Isn't that a great devotional? Here's our tip for today. Everybody figure this out. This is easy. I mentioned what type of apparel can you wear that will really help you in your fishing? <clears throat> can I say sunglasses? Polaroid sunglasses. Polarized sunglasses. You know, we were the ones years ago, back, uh, well, I guess I was in my 20s, that we sort of caused Polaroid or polarized sunglasses to become popular. They were called Polaroid in those early days. We have the Jimmy Houston sunglasses now. We sell tons of them through JimmyHouston.com. But, uh, but you can, uh, they're made by solar bat. The sunglasses are made by solar bat now. And, uh, and they're, they're, you know, inexpensive. They're not 200, 300, 500 dollars a pair. They're 20, 30 bucks a pair. But, um, but we, uh, Polaroid, the Polaroid company that invented the camera where the little pictures would slide out, an amazing thing that we had back in those early days before we had telephones that took pictures. It was fantastic. But, uh, but Polaroid developed the, the Polaroid process, and they, they had glasses, and they were all called Polaroid glasses because Polaroid was the only one that could make them back in those days. And they were actually the first ones we made. Our first Jimmy Houston Fisherman's glasses was, uh, was made with glass lenses in them. They were real heavy, which made them kind of uncomfortable, but they wouldn't scratch. They wouldn't mess up. I, had, I don't know how many pair we got where people had been hit in the eye, and it just shattered the glass. But they didn't even get a piece of glass or nothing. It shattered the glass, but no fragments or anything came out of it. Saved them from, from losing an eye. Slip sinker coming back and hitting it, or a jig or a spinner bait head coming back and hitting the eye. And uh, we always gave those people new sunglasses, of course. But, uh, but, but you know, they were, they were amazing. And, and you, could, 
You, those glasses just lasted forever. They lasted forever. Of course, we come a long way in sunglasses. They, they, it looks nice. They're a lot more stylish. Those, those old ones are kind of clunky looking, but boy, did they help you catch fish. Boy, did they help you catch fish. Now the process is called polarization, which is what it was. And now you, then you see none that say Polaroid because, uh, you know, the, the patents run out and it's allowed a lot of people to make polarized sunglasses. Don't go fishing without them. Even on cloudy days, make sure you have polarized glasses on. They will definitely help you catch more fish. You'll take the glare off the water. You'll be able to see fish you couldn't see. You'll be able to see stumps and grass and logs and stuff under the water that you couldn't see. It will help you even when you get a fish on and get him around the boat. You'll see him much quicker, uh, which allows you to see and watch and see how that fish is hooked. So you can, it depends on how he's hooked is how you fight him, how you land him. So uh, very, very valuable polarized sunglasses. Guys and girls, go out there and have you a great one. Remember, I sure do love you.